Hello all, I wanted to retest input latency on the Xbox Series X for Apex Legends, but I ran into technical issues with my camera. Today I resolved that issue. Apparently there was a patch in Season 13 that hurt the input lag on the Xbox Series X, but there was a fix sent out in early July. So today's input lag test was performed a few weeks after the fix was issued. I changed my input lag test slightly to measure the time in milliseconds between the sound of the click of a button press and the beginning of the rendering of a bullet marker which takes slightly longer than when I was testing previously. So previously I was measuring the change in the number of displayed bullets in the magazine. So in Apex, the bullet number changes slightly before the rendering of the bullet marker. On PC, the median controller input lag was 33 milliseconds. On the Xbox Series X, the median controller input lag was 108 milliseconds. That's a higher input lag on the Xbox Series X of about 75 milliseconds. Using my prior input lag test method, the input lag difference between PC and Xbox Series X would have been slightly shorter at about 65 milliseconds. When I tested this input lag difference last year, the difference was 50 to 60 milliseconds. So when comparing apples to apples, I think that the input lag has either stayed the same relative to PC or has grown a bit after some game updates on the Xbox Series X. This is a disappointing result. I hope they release the 120 FPS version of Apex on next-gen platforms and prioritize reducing input lag since these two issues make a huge difference when enjoying a game. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. Recharging shields. Manifest farm, no turning back now. Flying solo and I still...